Hello, my beautiful ones out there. So um, one of the things that you have to do when you start pursuing something that you're really excited about, whether it is a new business plan, a new business venture, whether it is a new job or career, or whether it's whatever it is that you're really positive about and, and hopeful about, if you have people in your life that are always doubting what you're hoping for, then you got to stay away from those people. You got to stay away from any person that's negative or doubtful about what you are believing God for. OK, because as long as you are staying around them and they're always consistently putting those seeds of negative thoughts into you, it's going to start taking root in you and you cannot have fear um, when you're trying to pursue something that is something you're hoping for. You got to have faith, right? You need to be around people that have faith with you. Not saying that, you know, you got to completely cut people off. But if what they are saying to you is instilling fear, if it's instilling doubt, if it's instilling anything that is going to hinder your full faith in what you're believing for, you're going to have to keep distance from them. You need to be around people that are supporting what you are hoping God for. OK, so. You know what this means to you, <laughs> um, whatever the case may be, you know what it means to you. Um, and these people may not be bad people, but they are always negative. They're always, you know, thinking negative thoughts about anything or putting fear in, in you. You got to stay away from them. OK, be around people that are positive and hopeful for what you're believing God for. Keep those people around you. That's your tribe.